All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy, Sid, your host, this is Functional, this Functional's World. Tune in to your thoughts from your boy, podcast. Peace. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, I'm your host, this, this Functional, this Functional's World. Yo, 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 what's on my mind? We had a great podcast the other night on Wednesday. Y'all should tune in, 7 o'clock. Live on Wednesday, 7 o'clock Central Time. But beyond that, um, we were talking about is it wrong to snitch on the dead? And we came up with some pretty interesting scenarios. And then a person that's in my life, one of my relatives, my brother actually, one of my other brothers, um, hit me with some game later on that night. He said he wished he could have tuned in, but he couldn't. But he hit me with a different perspective that we didn't think about. We didn't think about what happens, what are the repercussions of telling on someone is dead. Hmm. So, let me break it down for you. If you're a street person, or you have street ties, and the 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 the, the charge you put off on somebody that died is this. If you put off a charge that died, that somebody, if you put a charge on someone that died, such as murder, and they have family, children, brothers, sisters, uncles, cousins, um, relatives that are still of age and are in that lifestyle as well, You just gave them a target for your family because that body got put on somebody. They're not here to pay for it. But if they have people that are still living and the body that they caught or the body that you put on them was of a person that's in that lifestyle, that's in in the game, you just gave their people a, a, me, a person to retaliate against, your children, your girl, your brothers, your, your sisters, you just gave them somebody for them to retaliate against. Think about that. So if I'm the gay member and another gay member gets killed and I put it off on one of my homeboys that passed away, now his family got to look out because that body got attached to a name. That makes sense? So, because the body got attached to the name and that person was in a life, yeah, you just opened the Pandora's box to the retaliation on that man's family or loved ones, I should say. So, again, like I said, I wouldn't do a period because saying, saying that somebody else did something, you know, like my people hit me with, it's all fine and dandy until repercussion time come, which is what we're talking about now. Um, for the simple fact, you know, they're gone. Can't nothing happen to them. You know what I'm saying? But in my eyes, that's still a snitch. You told for your betterment, for you to lessen or get out of jail, you snitched. But in a deeper picture, you told, you put a body on somebody who's not here no more. Now, they kid, while you find your case, whether you beat it or don't beat it, while you find the case, there's people out that's looking for redemption. They want blood. They can't get to him. He gone. You say he did it. He gone. He, she, gone. You can't, they can't get to you. You know what I'm saying? Because you in the court system. So you either, you probably locked up. You're probably not out on bail. Most people are not out on bail. In movies or TV, you get out on bail. But most times, they don't let you get out on bail. Because a rational mind person ain't going to stay around and fight to try. He, he'll skip town, skip, you know, whatever. So you gave them a, a focal point to retaliate on. You can't stop it. You can't prevent it. You know what I'm saying? And if they're not in the lifestyle, they don't know how to protect themselves from it for real. I mean, they can move 
will probably call the police if they see a, a strange car. But, you know, like I made a joke, but I guess I was kind of serious. If you owe me money and I can't find you, your mind got to move. Like, on some real, real stuff. Like, because if I look for you too long and I can't find you, people that aren't expecting me to look for them, they're not hard to find. So, if I was to shoot that place up, then you got to come look for me. And I'm not saying this mind thinking is right or it was right because I don't, I don't partake in these activities anymore. But I'm just saying, theoretically, if I'm looking for you and I can't find you because you keep hiding in different people's house, but your mom is still at her house. That's all I'm saying. So in the, in the, in the scheme of things, it, it, it sounds messed up. And I'm sure it is to a point, but in the same point, if you do dirt, don't hide your hand. Somebody will pay for it, whether it's you or somebody else, but somebody will pay for it. And that's the same thing when you put a charge on a dead person, depending on what the charge is. Depending on what the charge is, and in this case, in this scenario, we're talking about murder. If somebody murders somebody, you put the charge on them because you want to get out. You have just opened the Pandora box on their family to become targets. Now, this is not going to be a long video because it's not, I have no one to debate with. But think about that. You get locked up. You and your people. I don't care what kind of bond or what they say. They tell you and they got kids or siblings, loved ones, period. And they tell you, I'm going to take the charge, put it off on me. And you do that and they in the life. Just know, you might have signed a warrant for their people to get slaughtered. If you can live with that, so be it. I can't live with stuff like that. I won't do stuff like that. So, with that being said, I'm your host, this. Like I said, tune in Wednesday, 7 p.m., 7 p.m. Central Time, we go live. Uh, as soon as we get enough uh, comments in the in the chat in, uh, in the comment section, talking about that y'all want to bring back the uh, tarot reading, I'll set that up for y'all. It'll be on a Tuesday, particularly later night towards 9, 10 if you're on the Eastern uh, East Coast Central Time, 8:30, 9 o'clock. If you're on the Pacific Time, it'll be somewhere around 7, 8 o'clock. Um, with that being said. Keep tuning in. We appreciate y'all. I'm your host, This Dysfunctional, Dysfunctional World. Peace.